So here we have a machine that's been infected with the Cutwell Trojan. Uh, this installs a rootkit as well onto the machine. And what we'll see now is we'll do a quick scan of Gmer um, to see where the rootkit has loaded itself. So there we can see it's called WinSP87.sys and it's loaded into various parts of the system. Next up we're going to see if Symantec Norton 360 version 2 fully updated can detect it. Hi there, so today we're going to show you Prevex uh, versus Symantec Norton 360 version 2 fully updated. This machine has been infected with a Trojan and a rootkit called Cut Whale, and we're going to see if Symantec detects it uh, first off. So we started the Symantec quick scan. The scan took about 40 seconds to complete, and at this end of the 40 seconds, we'll see now what it's found. Uh, it's found two security risks and one risk which has been resolved. Um, now we'll see what that is. Uh, it's basically saying that it's found a tracking cookie. And at this point, we're going to fix this item and then continue on and see what else it finds with a full system scan. So now it's um, removed that tracking cookie. Now we're going to do a full system scan and see what we find. Uh, I've cut the video and the full system scan took approximately 11 minutes to complete. It scanned some 160,000 files in that 11 minutes. At the end, it's still saying that it's only found those three cookies and it's happy with with what it's found. So now we're going to download and install Prevex CSI and see how, uh, how long it takes to detect and scan the system. So firstly we can see it was a one megabyte download from the website uh, against the other security products which were ranging from 60 to 100 megabytes. We're going to enter the license key and start the scan off. In general, this uh, scan would normally take about a minute and a half on a system. And this is scanning various uh, key areas of the system, as well as air all running processes and loaded modules and so forth. We can see that it's uh, found eight threats so far. Uh, it's still going. So it took 1 minute and 11 seconds. We can see it found a DLL and a rootkit driver and various registry keys for that. So the winctrl32.dll is, uh, is the DLL and the winpd54.sys is the actual rootkit driver that hides the DLL. And 
and we've also detected the associated registry, registry keys with that. At this point it's uh, cleaning up these files So we're going to do one more scan just to see if it has successfully removed uh, those threats. And this scan would be much quicker because uh, most of the entries have already been cached. Uh, so it won't have to re-verify all of them. At the end of this you'll see that um, all these threats have been removed and that Prevex CSI provides excellent incremental security to an existing antivirus on the desktop. All clean.